Welcome back to Heatherween as we play Silent Hill 3. First run through the game, so we're going to get the normal ending. It's the only one you can get on the first run. Where's the elevator? Turn right, loop around. We finished the first floor of the normal hospital. Didn't take long at all because it weren't made. Wait, how deep is the elevator? Oh, that's the end. Okay. Can't move the camera angle, so this is all we get to see. Oh, basement. Basement doesn't work. We're on one. I, s I assume one is where you start. That's what you would assume if you're American, anyway. I think in England they go like ground and then one, which, you know, seems to me like it would make more sense to go ground and then two, even if you want to call it ground. Oh, camera angle. That was a perfectly cromulent camera angle, but then it forced it back the other way. This hospital even still has the same like layout as it did before. The uh, map is the same, you know. What's this? A book? Oh, is it another, another thing from Carlton or whatever his name is, Stanley? He keeps making me dolls. He's weird. Ew! He's so creepy. You may not yet realize your own true feelings, but you sense them unconsciously. And you're trying to get closer to me. That's a virtue, the path to paradise. If the door's locked, open it. Use the password for the prison gates. Doctor, I've forgotten his name. Anyway, that quack has it posted. He should be here too. I mean, four numbers would have been good enough, but he kept on going. Isn't it a shame I'm not there? Aren't you irritated? I long for you, but you're so cruel. Still, I want you, Heather. Stanley Coleman. Take the doll, take the doll, take the doll. I want the doll. She won't, she won't take the doll. What's this? The big note on the wall. Oh gosh, okay, okay, this is a math problem. First is larger than the second. Second, twice the third. Third, smaller than the fourth. The fourth is half the first. So the first has to be at least two. And it's larger than the second. Which has to be at least two. And it has to be even. So it's, let's say the first is four. goes all the way up to nine, so that's a problem. <laughs> yeah, you can probably skip about five minutes if you don't want to see me working out a math problem. So the, f the first is even. It's got to have a half. So let's say eight. Let's just say the first is eight. Let's say eight, six. Eight, 
8634 Yeah, no repeats. 86 Three, four. I mean, that works, but it might not be the only solution. Eight, six, three. That was two in the right road. Oh, that was it. Okay. I was wrong about how long it would take. Since that was difficult to do, maybe we should, maybe we should explore the rest. Because at some point it's going to jump. At some point it's going to jump to Hell World, so maybe we should hold off on that. Because that might be the plot that gets us to Hell World. In which case, we don't want to miss anything before getting there. Any goodies? Let me... There's this one weird locker that's all scratched up. Huh. I wonder if it's going to be anything in the other world. Nail polish remover. Perfume. And somebody... Daint, somebody dainty had their locker here. Fashion magazines and dainty stuff. Oh, Justin Bieber poster. Oh, what's this poster on the wall? Can't really make it out. Oh, it's a motorcycle. Somebody on a motorcycle. Okay. So two doors on the left. Maybe take the elevator up to the next floor even. Just to, just to kind of avoid, avoid progressing the plot. Just in case there's any ammo or health items we might miss by not fully exploring. Oh, okay, never mind. This is the only other floor we can go to. Oh, the door won't open. We got the nail polish remover, so that could get us a key, which we might need down here, actually. That's a nurse with a pipe. I always do that lunge at a distance. Okay. Once again, I did not know that I was almost dead. The game signals. The continue is probably just going to put me at my save point, isn't it? The game signals you have damage by having a little heartbeat, but it doesn't get stronger or faster when the damage gets worse. So it's kind of like... See, I'm already in bad shape in my save. If 
three, nine, two. There it, I think there's also a little bit of a um, system where the game doesn't give you as much stuff if you already have a lot. So you don't want to hoard crazy amounts of stuff because then you just won't get as much more anyway. But I think it's pretty large numbers. Where's the elevator? I think it's pretty large numbers before it gets to where it uh, starts cutting off your supplies. Okay, let's do all this again. But we can go a little faster this time because we don't have to read anything. We already know the answer. anything down here, was there? Read this just in case you have to get it in your memos or whatever. I assume it's the same riddle. I assume it's not like randomized when you look at it. Eight, six, three, four. Yes. Okay, so yeah, that was pretty quick. Now we're back here with some health. Okay, that's the one with the club. Pistol whip, huh? Bitch. All right. That's right, there was a locked door. There's a locked door and I know where there's a key and I got the nail polish. Oh, it's an alarm. I thought that was a phone for a second. Four thirty two. Briefcase. 430. And there's four numbers. Whoops. 
Zero four thirty two. Huh? All right. Instant. Oh yeah, because the clock. Duh. Because the clock goes up to double digits on the hour. So you, yeah. Oh, we got a camera. Don't know what I would want with a Polaroid camera. Yeah, that's right. I said the brand name. I didn't say instant camera. I said Polaroid. Where's my endorsements money? Somebody call up whoever owns Polaroid. Does Polaroid even exist anymore? As a company. You can still get those cameras. They're not popular like they were, but they still have them. Which direction do I go? Left. Somehow I missed examining room three. The day room is locked. We learned that last time before I died. Oh. Shit, another room of three nurses. Are you kidding me? Let me out. Okay. There. You get one too. Shotgun, why are you not going down easy? Do they like... Do they heal? Do these things heal over time? Because I knocked her down with a shotgun. You would think she'd be on the verge of death. From that, right? But apparently not. Is that it? Just a health pack? That was not worth coming in here for that. Used up more than that amount of health in there. Okay, what's down here? Okay, so I can go downstairs and get the key. Don't know of anything I would want to take a picture of. There's an arm hanging out. I don't like that. All right, unknown patient. Died from blood loss. Hmm. Room M4. Keeps talking about room M4. Um, I've already been in there. I didn't notice anything. that I couldn't do yet. There's something written on his hand. Uh, was that going to be his passcode? What do you... Oh. That's what I'm going to use the camera for to read. I don't know why it won't let me just read it, but... Can't use this here? What do you mean can't use this here? Oh, I would just say to get in exactly the right spot. 
tart 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 to my key tart tart ill my key oh the start time is my key yeah I've already did that didn't I though I already figured it out I'm not stupid Elevator, get the key. Use oh, there's enemies in here now. Oh, yeah. Camera. Camera's gonna get me killed. Did I just hear somebody fire a gun? Shoot. That doesn't go around. Camera, oh God. I should have killed that nurse. I am trying to get a lot of kills and the nurses aren't that hard. I haven't actually been keeping count. I think you have to get 333 in between two playthroughs, or, well, however many playthroughs it takes, but we're going to do two before we need that count. Alright, so, turn around and go to C4, and get the key, which I guess maybe the key is to the stairwell. Maybe. Oh. The doll and the note are gone. Is he taking the same doll and the notebook and moving it around the hospital? Is he like actively doing stuff behind our black behind our back? Because that's pretty creepy. Yep, stairwell key. Okay. to save just to be safe uh -huh. just to be safe just to be safe So Stanley is the creepy guy. Vincent is the annoying glasses guy. Douglas is the detective. Claudia is the bitch. I think I've got that all straight now. Wait. Why did I get in the elevator? This is the stairwell that I wanted. That's what I got the key for. I 
I know there's something I want in the basement. I kind of looked up where all the different weapons are in the game. And some machine gun bullets. Yeah, we're just going to ignore that. Gonna ignore the squeaky wheelchair for now. Well, I guess we can't ignore it for long, but what's this? Okay, I guess it's squeaky wheelchair time. Squeaky wheelchair gets the greasing. Hey, it's like the Metal Gear Solid hallway where it's a blood trail. Because something, something horrible happened. Oh, oh dear. Somebody got submachine gunned real good. Oh, that's an Uzi. That's not what I was expecting. That's an Uzi. Why is she looking at the elevator? Part of me wants to peek in, but then it's a little creepy, too. Really? A bloody elevator? You've seen worse than a bloody elevator, Heather. So is that it? Nope. I figured there must be there must be something down here you have to get. Because generally the game does kinda push you towards finding all the stuff you want to find. Mostly. There's a light flashing. Hmm. So she can't fit through there, huh? Can't fit through, can't move the shelf. I don't think I have an item that'll work. Oh. I didn't look at the, uh, I didn't look at the notebook yet. Dad's notebook. All started 24 years ago, coming back from vacation, wife and I found a baby on the side of the highway. So that was the girl that you lost in the original Silent Hill. Then Harry's wife died. What's with all the dead wives in this series? So, and then that girl was Alessa. So, Alessa was killed, reincarnated into Cheryl. So Alessa dead, and then Cheryl, and then Cheryl dead. Into Heather. Yeah, this is what I just said. They're just really, really wording it longly, long-worded. 
In the end of the first game, he ran away with the baby if you get the correct ending. He doesn't mention Sybil. I'm not sure if Sybil was supposed to officially survive the first game or not. The canon ending, I'm not sure. Obviously, it's one of the endings where he gets the baby, though. Since that's how we got here. Oh, dear. So he does have some dark thoughts about Heather sometimes. Okay. Yeah, maybe I use the camera to take a picture of what's behind the bookcase. Blammo. I'm smart. Maybe the flashing light in the room is meant to be a hint to use the camera flash. Maybe. 9135. Okay. I don't know what that's for, but we've got a code or something. Alright, so there's nothing down here, right? We tried all the doors. Back upstairs. I think I've got that floor finished. Back upstairs. Second floor. Third floor. Yeah, we gotta get to the third floor. Okay, third floor. Is there, oh, there's not a... There was a save point in the stairwell in Silent Hill 2. Pretty sure it was this stairwell. It was a very similar looking stairwell anyway. I also like the rooftop. It makes me want to fly. You too? Stanley Coleman. The creepiest MF in Silent Hill. And that's really saying something. Oh, we can go up to the roof. I didn't think it would let me on the roof yet. No. Oh. Alright, we got two of these big boys. We got two big boys. Submachine gun bullets. Free submachine gun bullets, but. Ah. It's been a long time since we fought any of these big boys. I don't know if I even had the katana yet. Oh, it's doing a swing attack now. Ampule. We're pretty much in the red. How's the ammo situation? It's not great. Uh, 
I think I'm gonna s just stick with killing these with the sword. I think that'll work. Okay, maybe it's not going to work. These guys are taking a lot of damage. I'm doing big hits. Oh, he's down. Okay. Look, jerk. Let me kick this guy. Is he actually dead? Yeah, no more kicks. Okay. Now it shouldn't be so bad. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, it was so bad. I was wrong. Hmm? Special death scene. Oh. The creepy doctor is taking us. I'm probably not going to be happy with where he takes us. Let's see what continue does. Probably the save point, because that wasn't a boss fight. We didn't get any plot. Seems like it does continues at the, uh, the, the, yeah. Do not have the... thing yet. Uh, how far back am I going? I guess I've got the key. I guess I've got the key and we can just go to the stairwell. Is that where we are? Stairwell, basement, machine gun. Just mark these off on the map. Thirty-five. I assume that saves in my memo book. Ninety-one thirty-five. Just the wheelchair. Is that all you're looking at? It's not like another clip, is there? Why did the music do that? Let's 
let's see. 48, 18. There's plenty of room up here. So let's do the, um... Oh shoot, once you reload it, then I've got even less ammo. Hmm? Oh, the, I didn't pick those up yet. I didn't pick up the ones on the roof yet, so yeah, one clip just gets you 32 bullets, okay. Alright, there's plenty of room, so we'll use the pistol. Where these guys at least get one of them down. Come on. At least get one of these guys down. Before we try to do it with melee. Kind of fast. the ground. Fuck you. Okay, I think that one's dead. Two ampules. Still got some health. But not a lot of ammo. I've got more health than ammo, so I guess we're gonna. Oh, I didn't actually change my weapon. As I was just about to say, I guess we're gonna go with melee. So I've got more health than ammo. Yeah, that swingy thing sucks because you just can't be close to him. Goes all the way around. Okay, yeah, he's dead now. Okay. Was there anything else up here other than the ammo? Two submachine gun clips. That might still be worth it just for that. This is where James got knocked through, right? Pyramid head knocked him. Or maybe it was here. It was one of those. James got knocked off the roof. I guess that's all that was up here. Oh well. Good enough. Kind of weird, the guy said something about flying and James flied off the roof. Or flew off the roof, you might say. OK, 
Okay, that's going to be a door that goes to a whole nother hall. Let's try this way. Memo on the wall. Punishment for brutality towards patient. 12 hours confinement in special treatment room. The trick is not to leave any marks. The chief is a pervert. Christy would have been better off if she'd been fired. Hmm. Uh-oh. They got a punishment room. And the chief is a pervert. That sounds bad. Is this Christy? Is this the punishment room? Sorry, Christy. in here. An another notebook and doll flowing freely. I, I don't I don't have ebony hair, sir. I have I'm blonde. Flowing freely, your ebony hair like the night sky, scattering fragrance. He's, he's picturing Alessa, isn't he? He's picturing the even younger one. No, 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 no. Superbly enjoyable to drown in my love for you, but why won't you accept proof of my love? Don't stand on ceremony now. After all, you and I exist as one. What I give to you is the same as what I give to me. Stanley Coleman. Fantastic. So I don't know, uh, it seems like something should be going on in that room, is this a door that I, store room, okay. Save room. Stun gun battery, health drink, health drink, I haven't tried the stun gun yet. I don't know if I ever used it the first time I played either. I mean, it's got no range. And not much ammo, so... Well, we'll come back to the save room after we do a bit more exploring. So the elevator will come up here once you're up here, which is weird. Oh, is it just the interior button doesn't work? The button itself broken? Camera, please. Is there something on that bucket? It looks like there's something on the bucket. It was glimmering, but no. Just something shiny. Just something shiny as part of the decoration. All right. A 
only one way to go. It's locked. Oh. I don't remember what the number was. Alright, memos. Whoops. Memos. Um, photo on chair, picture in the gallery. I need photo behind the bookcase. Backside of shelf. 9135. I wonder what that one note, one note at the beginning of the hospital. He was talking about four numbers would have been enough, but he kept on going. Is there a five number combo at some point? Ooh, I think S12 was... There's a lady magazine. I think S12 was, um... Teaching to Spare Hope House. Orphanage on the outskirts of Silent Hill. I think that might show up in Silent Hill 4. Kidnapping and Brainwashing. Silent Hill Smile Support Society. Weird prayers and children crying. Suspicious looking concrete tower. Ooh. Yeah, that's in Silent Hill 4. Unfortunately, no one's willing to tell us what the tower was used for. Well, as a prison. Yeah, the chosen people, crazy religions. They got weird drugs, too. It doesn't seem like they mention it much, other than in the first game. Health drinks. Health drinks. Okay, health drinks and info about an orphanage. S12 was where the really scary guy was going to be down at the end of the hall, I guess. Something on the bench. Jerky. Beef. Jerky. Jerked beef. All these doors locked. No, not this one. And it's this guy again. It's this guy with this creepy doll situation again. Oh, he's torn the leg off. He's mad. He's mad that I've rejected his advances. Frickin' incels, man. Goodbye, Heather. I'm sorry I wasn't able to respond to your love. Actually, I was the one not responding to yours. It's all over. Leonard despises me. Because I made fun of it, saying it would come to this. Who's Leonard again? Oh, Leonard is the scary guy. If it weren't his meddling, I'd been able to meet you in just a little while. Then I could have taken you to my world. A world for us alone, more beautiful than this one. I guess he's talking about Hell World? And I've been waiting for this day, for today. The day I'd see you, the day you'd save me. Today, Heather, watch out for him. Leonard is no ordinary guy. Farewell, I love you. Heather, my goddess, my lover. My lover, I, I misspoke there in my own journal diary entry. So, 
Well, the creepy guy got killed by somebody. A bit scarier. Oh, the nurses ambushed me. They came from both sides. That one's got a gap. There's two over there. It was S12, wasn't it? That Leonard was in. Oh, you're close. Well, I really wailed on her. She ain't going down, though. Pretty sure. Yeah, pretty sure it was S12. Let's try all the other doors first. Because that might be the room that sends us to Hell World. S9. I think 7 was the one I went in. Yeah, that's all locked. Locked. Elevator won't respond. That should be this floor finished. S12. The only place left to go. Leonard, are you... He won't be in here, obviously. Controller's not vibrating, but it does look like I've got a bit of damage. Just in case Leonard is in here, let's get healed up. Yeah, I knew he wouldn't be. Whole bed stinks like... You year old sweat. Responsibilities. Have you come to apologize? Or maybe you still don't realize how foolish you've been. The salvation of all mankind. Ah, what a ridiculous dream. Wait, just listen to me for a second. I've heard enough from you already. How did you turn out this way? Where did I go wrong? Listen to me already. I'm not Claudia. Not Claudia. My name is Heather. Heather. Who are you? Leonard Wolf. I'm sorry. I thought you were my daughter. All right, we going to Hell World now. Claudia is your daughter? Oh, so you know her, do you? Are you one of her followers? No, never. When I find her, I I'm... I can feel the hatred. What? Behind your words, the anger. You plan to kill her, don't you? I'm sorry. But she, she killed my father. She's a fool, but she's still my daughter. I was going to forgive her if she changed her ways, but I see it's too late. Heather, will you help me? Help you? I'm locked up in here, and I must stop Claudia. Where are you now? I'm not sure myself, but the door is at the end of the hall on the second floor. I think I can be of help to you. I have a seal. Please. A seal? 
Ezio? The end of the hall on the second floor. Second floor, hmm, end of the hall. Where's the nearest safe point? Guess we gotta go to the first floor to hit a safe. There's only one safe point in this main hospital, so. Let's save and then let's just see. I do want to finish, at least, gosh, it's been more than a whole hour just in the regular hospital. Just in the regular hospital without even getting to the other world. According to the playtime, though, because that doesn't include deaths. It doesn't include replaying when you die. All right. I'm not sure the clock. I'm not sure the clock is actually really accurate. Anyway, into the hall, second floor. Just see what this does if it takes us to Hell World. Probably wouldn't be a boss fight yet. We just had a boss fight. Probably a boss fight at the end of Hell World, I would imagine. Hell Hospital. Oh, there's an enemy somewhere. Okay, end of the hallway. He said end of the hallway, but like... What does he... Oh, let's turn right. I assume the long hallway with the rooms. Don't hear any enemies. Is something going to be different now? Yes. Where'd that come from? That wasn't there. This didn't used to be here. This must be Hell Hospital, though, because, yeah. Because we've already done the entire normal hospital. Or it's it's a secret. It's a secret hidden mine shaft off of the hospital for some reason. How is this on the second floor? This... Feels like it's underground, but I guess maybe not. Well, I was going to turn anyway, but I guess I really have to now. All right. Only one way to go. We got greats telling us where to go. Door. I can't change the camera. I 
I wonder if it would let you... I wonder if it's possible to like run up under one of those and get smushed. Hmm. Dead end. Hmm. Hmm. Didn't I go this way? Oh. this going to go on? One would be enough. This this save symbol doesn't make my head hurt when I look at it. Still has an unusually high heat. Eyes don't open. Getting a pulse, but just barely breathing. Why? What is keeping that child alive? What the hell was I daydreaming? It was more like watching a video in a dark room, but that nurse, I know her. Lisa. From the first game. Who was so heavenly toward me in that hellish hospital room. She did get a little weird, though. Yeah, she, she, uh, kind of turned into a zombie. Okay, the wall with the safe thing on it. Lift it up. Okay. Um... I hear a heartbeat. We got a ladder. We got a weirdo. We got a wiggly wall. Uh oh. He's turning a valve. What's that valve going to do? I don't know. There's a lady in bondage. We got some Freddy Krueger walls. Oh. That doesn't look good at all. Okay, we're on the third floor. Okay, these walls are very bad. We really need to get some renovations going on in this hospital. Can't even tell if there's an enemy nearby or if that's just the music of the level. Yep, we're in we're in the flesh tube now. It's not pleasant. Everything is crawling with crud. Piece of meat or something on the ground. Can I grab the piece of meat on the ground? flush hallway. Wiggly. Wiggly flesh. Okay, this room's not wiggling at least. Oh. 
What am I looking at here? It's just a pole. Probably doesn't mean anything. Oh, okay. Okay, there's definitely going to be enemies in here. Oh god, it's those fucking things. I hate those. Uh, I don't think the stun going to work, but it, she probably does it at like waist level. How's my ammo? Oh god. Terrible. Terrible is how it is. Shit. Well, we're in bad trouble now. I probably should try to kill them. Might have to come through here multiple times. Looks like there are some doors there that aren't blocked off that I went by. I hate those, I hate those enemies. Wait, there's something on the ground here. Is that, no, nothing. Let's see, I've got, I've, I think I've got all the guns you get in this game. It's locked. It's hard to really see what you're trying to do here. So all the walls look wiggly, but apparently some of them are still counted as openable doors. Okay, now I'm ready to find a save room. I've got a blood bucket. Dripping from an upside down figure. Is that Walter Sullivan? Blood, blood, blood draining. Do I have anything I can collect blood with? The perfume attracts enemies. Perfume attracts enemies, so you only use that if you want to fight a lot, to get a lot of kills. It's not going to let me dip the pendant in blood is it no okay well we've got a bucket of blood I don't know what to do with it if anything Okay, there's a save room. Okay, so we're in the Hell Hospital. There's a hand clawed onto the window by the hand gun bullets. The hand outside the window. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What about it? Well, we're in Hell Hospital. We'll be back next time to finish Hell Hospital. time.